Hello guys, little buddy 524 here and welcome to another episode of Mind Flip. As you can see, we've done a lot, a lot of work on the LB towers. I've done a lot uh, off camera because I was, um, I don't know, I was just kind of, it was easier for me to work back and forth with um, looking at the, um, looking at my creative world and then coming back here building what I needed. So as you can see, my little buddy is floppy right now. And this has been the bane of my existence since I built this thing. I don't know who it is, but somebody on the server has been messing with my bridge. These two blocks, for some reason, just these two. Thank you, Kai, for the wheat. Anyways, these two blocks right here, um, they keep getting replaced. So, um, I don't know why it's so high up. So, we're going to just dig this out here and figure out what's underneath. Uh, yeah, we'll get these off first, because then we can have half slabs for uh, fixing it. Like, okay, it's the f it's just started out with me having a creeper blow up there, and now it's kind of turned into every time I replace those blocks, which I've done probably 15, 20 times now, um, it's they keep getting replaced. I don't know who's doing it. I've asked a lot of the guys on the server who's been doing it. And I'm sp suspecting Rez, but I that's just because Rez is a troll. Um so I it could be Dooger. It honestly could. I like men. Little buddy 524. Wow. Wow. Get off here. I don't know, and I've tried I've tried leaving it like that. Seriously, Kai? Do it. Anyways, yeah. I don't know who's doing it, but um they need to stop. So I've been also doing a little bit of strip mining while I was out there. Um, I've been doing actually a lot of strip mining. I've decided this year that I can't, or this season I can't do any mining, like normal mining, because I just keep dying and I lose all my stuff and all that stuff. So um, here's my haul. Actually, this isn't one haul. This is several hauls. But I got, let's see how many diamonds we got here. 17 diamonds. That's a pretty good haul, actually, from that. And I got seven last time I was out. I also have a whole bunch of iron smelting over here. And I hope to do an enchantment with you guys sometime soon here. Depends on how many levels this gets me here. Um, there you go. We got 23 levels. That's not bad. Got the stone, little buddy? Um, what stone? I don't even know what Stoney's talking about. Who knows? Okay. So. Yeah, today I don't know what we're going to do. Uh, I think I want to work on this fountain over here in this front uh, area. This is going to be actually inside of here. This is going to be part of the foyer, main foyer area. Where so I'm gonna have like a little sitting area and probably either a restaurant or something like that that's gonna be in there. Wow, we're getting a little bit of frame rate drop in here. At spawn I've been really dropping frames lately. So I don't know what's wrong, but yeah. But this is gonna be the color that we're gonna go with for the scheme of the building. That's gonna be a lot of the building's gonna be that color and white. So whites and yellows are gonna be our our friend here. The contrast between this here and that yellow is really, really nice. And same with the white and the yellow, it looks good. Also, this is gonna this ice is gonna be a really big part of our build too. So, I'm sorry about the frame drop. This is weird. Let's look this way. There's something wrong with this side. Maybe it's all the snow sheets. I don't know. It's weird. Anyways, that's Dooger's TNT or not Dooger's TNT? Kai's TNT. I also got to still finish this up here. Get that all finished up. It's just got to get a whole bunch of snow and put it there. 
I might put some more windows down this end, like these little cool uh, slats and stuff. I don't really know what to call them other than slats or windows. So, all right, I'm going to go down to the zombie spawner. That's this way. Actually, I don't know if you guys know where that is, so let's go over there and check it out. I'll actually just cut the recording here, and I will come back to you guys when we're over there. See you guys in one minute. All right, so we're approaching the zombie spawner now. And that's our zombie spawner so far. It's not really all that great. It's pretty slow. Um, I think... Who's here? Dude, you're here? Yeah, dude, you're here. Okay. Okay, well, we can't farm XP right this minute. But um, we'll have to do that a little bit later then. Um, so I'm going to go get uh, the supplies all prepped up for the, uh, for the fountain. And I will be right back. Well, everybody, I found the source of my lag. It's these guys. Unfortunately, my friend Kai has decided that he needs this many sheep. All I have to say, Kai, is make the damn thing bigger. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's not even enough, like... Not enough grass in that place to feed all those sheep. What are you doing? Oh, man. Kai, you don't think, do you? Give me a second. Oh, why did I get more iron out? Let's put this iron in here. We'll just keep a couple, because I'm going to need probably two swords. That's also an, one really big annoying thing about this update, is that the fact that zombies just eat your swords. Like, the you... Uh, you get, you t attempt to, um, sorry, I'm fumbling on my words, but, um, anyways, you kill probably 10 or 15 of them, and you're out of a sword. It's it retarded. You have the, uh, it used to be like, oh, a couple of zombies, whatever. Now you're spending, like, entire nights sitting there and, like, killing zombies and stuff. It's really making it extremely hard for me to, um, for me to build this, but I guess once I'm up up top and stuff like that, I should be fine. But yeah, this is definitely a source of our problem over here. I should have made a. You know what? Let's just make a shovel. Never mind killing them. Now I have two swords. Oh well. I'm gonna throw this sword. Here, get out of here, seeds, and you can go in there. Make one shovel. One shovel should do, I think. Shouldn't be a big deal. Also, I've been thinking about uh, recording with Faithful32 on, but we'll show, I'll show you Faithful32, um, that texture pack, just after we expand the sheep farm a little here. So actually, I'm just, I don't want you guys to have to watch this, but uh, I'll be right back after I farm, like, expand the sheep. Alright, so I'm back and I fixed my lag problem. So much better. All these sheep are relatively gone. I didn't even want this much sheep in the first place, but, you know, it's fine. Um, other than that, though, uh, actually, Pengi helped me out. See, there he is right there. Doop. Thank you for helping, Pengi. He did a very good thing. And we almost have 30 levels because I killed them all. Dude just coming over to check it out. Um, it's not good. It was... A long time of me sitting there slaughtering, uh oh, slaughtering uh, these guys. I got a few levels out of it actually. I was at 20 I think when I left you guys, and I got nine levels from just sitting here and uh, killing them. So um, I'm recording. Scene. So. Yeah, so, anyways, we're going to go over to the mob farm quick. I will. Ouch! Oh, no! I thought that was an angry zombie. I thought it was an angry enderman. But it's not an angry enderman, it's just zombie hitting me. <laughs> okay, let's go back over here, because we're not too far. Only takes a few seconds to hop on over. Yeah, I don't know what's making it so laggy over there at spawn, uh... I'm not getting any lag out this way, so. 
who knows could be something weird happening over there with the spawn chunk and stuff like whoa random frame drop that was bad all right i'm just gonna stand here for a few seconds here um actually if you guys haven't known this didn't know this we have an overviewer for this map actually so you guys can check out the overviewer um i'm gonna link that in the description for this episode just so you guys can see that um it's an alter vista website so it's just mindflipoverviewer.altervista.org you can check it out you can check out what we our spawn looks like and all that stuff you can check everything out it's actually going to be updated quite often because static grip is very nice that grip is very nice and he's going to do that for us i was originally the one that had to update it and all that stuff but um he has much better internet than me and he has a much better computer than i do so it takes him a lot less time to get that all worked out you can also even see uh what our signs say on them and stuff like that hey guy um and there we go 30 levels let's go enchant ourselves a diamond pick so i'm gonna walk over to the house again and i will be right back when i get there all right so we're just walking up on the house now and actually the frames are definitely lower here and i don't understand it but uh maybe just be because of those sheep um we're gonna grab some of this uh at oh behind behind the tower that way okay so we're gonna grab three of these and I lost lost my fortune pick last time so I'm going to uh, hope for a fortune pick um, my fortune pick was also efficiency four so I want a fortune pick because I'm gonna need a lot for a lot of quartz and a lot of diamonds because yeah <laughs> dude has been having his bookshop up and running and we might buy some books from him eventually I actually did uh, did buy some off camera but I lost my sword that I got from him so let's go with the first one boom oh we missed boom Un wow unbreaking three alright unbreaking three guys that's not the best but I guess it won't break <laughs> We can maybe even put an efficiency book on there. Uh, or something like that. Yeah, no. No, it's not cool. <laughs> no, I need some. No, I need some. Alright, let's check out what he has in his shop here. Sharpness power, sharpness power, sharpness power yep he doesn't have anything I want um, so I guess we will just uh, leave this then all right so I didn't prep the materials before uh, because I was too busy worrying about my frame rate lag and stuff like that so let's just do that quick and we can start building uh, we can start. I'll terraform this up, and then we can start building the fountain. So I will be ready. all right. Well, I'm almost finished terraforming, and uh, I think I'm gonna give you guys a little, a little bit of footage, like strange foot, and actually some trolley footage. Um, we got Dooger on right now, and we got Mr. Pengi on. So I think it's time for a little bit of. Splash Potion of Invisibility. This sounds like a good time to do it. And it's going to be kind of fun. I can't wait to do it. So let's just... Um, I'm going to cut here. And I'll continue doing this while you guys watch a little bit of fo footage of me. Um, trolling some people with Invisibility Potions. How's that sound, guys? All right. Sounds good, so I will be right back after this. Okay, guys, we're back, and I got my invisibility potion. I'm going to drink it as soon as I find them, okay? Um, I'm going to look for them from a distance. I want to 
I don't know why I'm whispering, but I'm going to take off my armor. And we're going to go. I'm going to keep drinking the potion. I'm going to throw all this stuff away. So we don't have anything except for these. And that's good. Okay, here we go. We're going to get Pengy. Let's get him. I'm going to follow him around. Hey, Pengy. Oh, he just left. Well, that's a damper on things. That sucks. Okay. Where's Dooger? Dooger's probably at the mob spawner. Ah, uh, sure. Let's sleep. Go run over to Static's house and sleep while we have our eight minutes of invisibility. Okay, so Dooger's the only one on with me now, so this is not going to work so well. But maybe he'll get freaked out by it. Who knows? We'll figure it out in a minute. Hopefully he doesn't come back. There we go. Perfect timing. Perfect timing. All right, let's go over there now, and we'll get him. Uh, should we bring... No, we got six minutes. We're good. Thought I saw Kai behind, or not Kai, uh, Dooger behind me. Oh no! <laughs> That's funny. Okay, this is not even a being a successful troll here. It's just him. It's just him getting an invisible spider hit me. Oh yeah, good, good, good. good. Pangy's back. Ready? We're gonna get him now. <laughs> Once he shears the sheep. <laughs> Looking around like, hey, what's going on? Hey, right, guys, what's going on? I don't know. I don't know, what's going on? He's like, oh my god, what's going on? <laughs> Alright, now let's see if we can go get Dooger. I don't know where Dooger will be. He might be over at the at the spawner. Could probably opt to find it. Let's see. Is he at his house? Nope, not his house. Must be at the spawner. Let's go this way. Check it out. Oh, do I still have food? I still have food. Okay. Um, we'll know in a second if he's there, because he usually takes his horse over. Let's see, yep, his horse is there. Let's see if he's there. Oh, we could ride his horse and be invisible. This would be awesome. Here we go. Let's, let's go hit him from behind. He'd be all confused and stuff. Really? <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, let's go back, and we'll get back to doing what we should be doing. So, you guys, thank you all for watching this little part of the video, because it was, it was fun. I, that's the first time I've trolled anybody with one of those potions. So, um, yeah. All right. I will be right back. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed that footage there. And I have some kind of sad news. 
Uh, I don't actually have enough dirt to terraform this all out, and I really don't want to go collect anymore right now, because I actually have to go to work very, very soon, and I didn't anticipate that, actually, so... I also don't have enough, um, water, and, like, well, I can go find water, but I don't have enough, um, source blocks, and not source blocks, you know what I mean, uh, glowstone, that's what I need. I need glowstone for the bottom, and I also need, um, some stuff around here. What? Oh, dude wants me to look at his pickaxe. Efficiency 5. Nice. Nice. Yeah, so, I'm gonna do this in the next episode. But um, I just wanted to say thank you all for watching this episode of Mind Flip. Make sure to go check out the overviewer. Um, I'm going to have that down in the description, but the, the link to it is mindflipoverviewer.altervista.org. So if you guys want to go check that out, see what our place looks like from above, and kind of check out everything else. I'm going to start this thing where I'm going to just wander around, and wherever significant events start or happens, uh, me either when I'm recording or when I'm not recording, I'm going to... I'll leave a sign just for you guys to go check out as like kind of an Easter egg of the uh, overviewer. Um, this year, uh, after I'm done this build, I really want to do sort of like a, I don't know, I want to try and raise some money for charity. So I want to do kind of kind of a Kurt J. Mack sort of deal. Uh, walk, walk in one direction or do something special. Um, something that's going to be not fun to do but make it entertaining to watch. I'm still going to have this base at home and then have all my diamonds and all my good stuff here, but then go walking um, in certain places. So, all right, again, thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys next time.